Hey there guys, this is Burbank51 here with a minor beat free indie game gameplay commentary. Uh, minor beat's a really fun game. Uh, let me show you it. <laughs> so as the name sort of implies, minor beat is based all around this beat. Oh. Is a bullet hell shooter. Uh, use. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. Ooh. Oh man. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna let this guy chase me before I get to the next wave. Yeah, it's a bullet hell shooter created by Jonathan Sodestrom the Swedish indie game designer who created Hotline Miami. Alright, we're gonna keep on going here. But to be honest, I'm not really sure uh, about how, all the ins and outs of this game. Uh, right now I know there's only... there's the X... Z keys. Whoa! Oh man, <laughs> that's the furthest I've gotten so far. Supposedly you can use the C and the F1, F2, F3 keys. I tried using the F1, F2, and F3 earlier, and all it did was uh. Oh. Okay, so when you press the X key, you kind of have to move a little bit to shoot out those things. I tried using F1, F2, F3, and all it did was minimize uh window and log me out of the game. But yeah, anyway, this is a really fun and addicting free game. has a really cool art style. Um, I'll be putting the link right in the description so you guys can download it and play it yourselves. Just going to, in this commentary, see how far I can get in the game. Let's see if I could get to that boss again and maybe beat him this time. Uh. <laughs> Alright. Doing good. Alright. Let's go. game I think was made in um, Game Maker, which is an old uh, program, an old game engine that was made to be accessible to uh, designers that maybe didn't have a bunch of experience. It's sort of like an introduction to game design. It uh, advertised that you didn't really need to uh, know a lot of scripting and coding, but um, even with that program, you kind of do. I played with it a little bit back in the day. Yeah, uh, the creator of this game, uh, I remember watching an interview with him once, and uh, he mentioned that, uh, yeah, he got into Game Maker because just because of that, because you couldn't, you didn't have to program. But he says that now programming uh, and scripting and whatnot has become uh, become his became his favorite part of uh, game game design. And now he's gone on to make a. Uh, Games like Hotline Miami and its sequel that should be coming out pretty soon. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna try two more tries, guys, and then I'll I'll let you guys go. Um, and Hotline Miami, that's a game. If you haven't heard of it, it's a lot of fun. We're, we'll probably be doing a little gameplay of that 
soon in the future. And of course, if you guys know of any good uh, indie games, go ahead and post them in the comments and I'll make sure to uh, play them in uh, future gameplay. Uh, seeing as I don't have a lot of uh, subscribers right now, I think I'd be... Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll try to get on uh, any suggestions you guys have uh, as soon as I can, so you might, you guys might see an immediate uh, gameplay of the games you suggest. This plane call me. Right. Oh! Did I say I was going to do two more? I'll, I'll do one more. Sorry, guys, if I'm not talking right now. Seeing as it's my last try, I'm gonna try to concentrate a little bit better. Uh, all right, that's it, guys. That's my new beat. Um, it's a free indie game. Links in the description. Go download it, play it. Let me know how you guys did. Maybe even do a video of it and uh, post it as a reply to this video. Um, I hope you guys have a good day, a good week. I'm going to try to be doing multiple videos every week, so look out for my next video soon, and uh, see you guys later.